Hey folks, welcome back to a Bird Dating Simulator 2014, um, otherwise known as Hotoful Boyfriend. Uh, we are on the second day and I actually had to restart my game because uh, for some reason it just sort of froze up here when I loaded it. Uh, the text box was not there and um, Sensei Bird was just kind of hanging out on my screen. There was nothing I could do about it, you know, not that that's a real big problem. He's a handsome bird and all. But, uh, you know, I kind of like to progress with the game here. Let me go ahead and just uh, save. Just in case. There we go. So, let's, uh, let's go back to bird school. Er, I think we want to choose the class council today. As you all know, this school doesn't require you to join any club. If you want to, you can. But if you don't, then you're free to go home after school. Well, that's nice. Cool. Oko-san has time only for the track team. Oko-san is the, the one bird that does not have a human portrait, by the way. Uh, yeah, there's something is weird about him. That's good. What about you, Shirogane? And this guy's just an asshole. I already hold, I already hold a position here. Yeah, I'm sure you do. Oh, that's right. You became student president when you were at... What? Oh, that is some bullshit. I didn't vote for him. Nepotism, ho! <laughs> Don't we get to vote? Yeah, see? I was just saying. Also, he is a ho. Just coming to school is enough for me. Ah, oh, Ryota's back. You have to take care of your mother on your own and all. Hmm, I wonder what I should do. Join the... Student Council, Track Team, Library Staff. Uh, let's see, I might get to talk to Nageki if I go with the library. But you know what, I'm, I'm going with the Track Team. I, I gotta see what Oko-san's up to. That's everyone, isn't it? Have fun! Today's an elective day, what should I do? I'm getting choices now. Attend. Yes. Math class, gym class, music class. Ah, music. We sang birdie melodies. It was a little tiring, but singing together is fun. Ta-da! Okay. Sarah leveled up. Charisma increased by five. Woohoo! I need to go sign up for track. I want to join the team, but I wonder if Okosan's having a fit again. Yeah, there, there was something about a pudding, uh, and he was kind of tripping balls over that. I don't know um, what the deal is. I'll find out when I get there. There he is. Cool. A Sarah appears. Is this a challenge then? Choose your weapon, ma'am, and draw. A fit he is having, though not over pudding. Oh shit, what is his deal now? Not really. I want to join the team. Do you know where the captain is? Goo! He stands before you. Okosan is the captain, a faster bird the world has never known. Aw oh, shit. I never knew. Oh, well, here, my forms. Thank you. Goo! A dove never refuses a challenge. Commence the entrance examination. Aw, oh, snap. There's an exam? Coo, of course. Track isn't daisy chain making, Missy. Coo. Okosan will be your opponent in noble combat. Sprint or long distance? Well, let's see. He's fast. Um, but does he have endurance? Is the question. I'm gonna go long distance. Coo! Long distance, you've got guts, let us begin. Coo, coo! On your mark, get set, go! How is he so fast? He can't even fly this fast. That's <laughs> his little bird legs going. Pant, pant. <laughs> coo! You're still weak, but you've got potential. Welcome to the team! Oh, and uh, Steam just popped up. I have a trading card. I've got a, a bird card. <laughs> Thanks. Thank you. Thank you for the bird card. Coo. That's all, folks. 
And so I joined the track team. Who knew dubs could run like that? This is what it sounds like when dubs fly. Run. Whatever. Ah, sitting at home is so... Do I live in a cave? Oh. Tomorrow is the class hike. Oh, God. Should I prepare anything? We won't be going far, so I don't have to. Well, health first. I think I'll have some udon and go to sleep. I live in a cave? Today is the hike. We've stopped for a break on a hillside. Who should I talk to? Talk to... Ryota? Sakuya? I'm gonna talk to Ryota. I wanna see how he's doing. Ryota, let's eat together. Sure. Great view, huh? This is my uh, childhood bird friend. My bird bro. Huh? Is that your lunch, Sarah? Yep. It's a calorie... Mm, <laughs> Narrowly avoiding product placement there. That's a pretty sad thing to bring on a picnic. No, it's not. A great man once said it's the ambrosia of the gods. Uh-huh. Solid snake. Jeez, if you eat like that, you'll be dead on the roadside by the time we get back. Here, I'll share mine. Oh, good. Yeah, give me your grubs and bugs and stuff. Really? Wow. Thanks, Ryota. And so I got to eat half of Ryota's lunch. His cooking is so good. We can save the calorie in case of a survival situation. <laughs> Yeah, sometimes in uh, anime you'll see they'll they'll put like punny brand names on stuff to get around the product placement issue. Uh, here it appears they didn't even try; they just blanked out the the letters. And yeah, today's an elected day. What should I do? Uh, attend. I'm gonna go to gym today. It's too hot. I feel like I'm gonna have a stroke. Cool. It is rehydration time. Okosan wants to go swimming. Oh, good. I leveled up. Yay! Vitality increased by five. Whoop de doo. All right, I imagine you're all well aware, but the sports festival is right around the corner. Please think about what you'll do. Well, I already run track. Sports festival season already? If it were in the fall, it would conflict with the cultural festival, so it's always been in May. What are you going to do, Ryota? I haven't decided, but probably the three-legged race. Some birdie has to. Goo. Okosan will handle the marathon. Indeed he will. <laughs> oh, God. You do have a lot of stamina, Okosan. What about you, Sakuya? You can't possibly be expecting me to run in some race, can you? It is a sports festival. Is there an event that doesn't involve running? How about being a cheerleader? <laughs> well, he certainly has the tail for it. The general, in other words. Very well, leave it to me. Oh, shit. Um, I, I don't think that's, um... Also, the first aid team is always shorthanded, so I'm sure they could use some help if any birdie still can't decide. Oh, I got email. That's all for today. Ryota's doing the three-legged race, Okosan's running the marathon, and Sakuya's a cheerleader. Yuya might be running the first aid tent. Oh yeah, that's uh, Sakuya's older, hotter brother. Less assholeish brother. What should I do? I'll have to think about it. Oh, it's not gonna let me pick now. Today is the sports festival. I never did make up my mind. What should I do? Go to the um library? No, I don't think so. I'll do the three-legged race with the uh, Ryota. Oh, are you joining us? Yeah, sure. Want to run together? I haven't found a partner yet. Okay. Yeah, I'll just. <laughs> Just tie him to my leg and <laughs> get set, go. Ryota's running for both of us. Pairing up a bird and a primate might have been a bad idea. We somehow came in second anyway, though. We have brought honor to our class. 
Okay, are these human-sized birds? Is that what this is? Because I'm pretty sure I can run faster than a pigeon, and I run like a 12-minute mile. Okay, come on. The first barrier for all students who make it this far, the midterm exam. We're getting them back today. Ah, I don't think I did too well. Kazuaki, Bellum. Yes. Hmm, I don't think you did too badly. Yes? Not too... Mm, nope, sorry, you did badly. <laughs> no. Try harder next time, okay? I disappointed Mr. Nanaki. I'll have to study more from now on. <laughs> I've disappointed my sensei. <laughs> I'm so sorry, sensei bird. With the festival in the midterm over, there's nothing to look forward to but summer heat. Doves smell kind of funny when it gets humid like this. Huh? There's a bunch of birds in front of the staff room. What are they doing? Oh, there's Yuya. Oh, shit. Yuya, what's going on? Salutations, Sarah. Brian won his seventh Pulitzer. Brian? He gestures at a news clipping on the staff room pinboard. It says, Brian, the first intelligent pigeon crowned again. Brian? Is he a Canadian pigeon by any chance? Don't tell me you don't know who he is. I think I've heard the name, but... He's the world's most famous blogger. He began when birds were barely intelligent. So the birds are evolving then. That's what this is. He's, very skilled. He's a very skilled and insightful writer. He was the one who suggested that the Dove Olympics be called the Pidge Olympics. <sighs> okay, that, that does not take a, a Pulitzer winner to come up with that, really. He's extremely influential. The name was adopted right away. Why don't you look him up right now, Monami? Try googling Brian Pigeon. Brian Pigeon. Okay! Okay. Uh-oh. Lunch is nearly over. Adieu, Sarah. Hmm, today is a good day. I feel like I'm shining. I wonder what I should do during break. Go to the... Store? Infirmary? The cafeteria. I'll go to the store. I don't really need anything, but I think I'll go to the store. You know, as one does. I've never really looked around there before. Is this a pigeon store? Oh, well, they've got all sorts of things for sale. Though these nest building materials look like what you'd find in a human store's trash. That's, well, you know, birds do build nests out of all kinds of lint and twigs and string and whatever they can find. My, how mature of you, Monami? Planning to settle down already? Uh, Yuya. No, that's not it. I'm still a high school student. That may be so, but you know we doves reach sexual maturity within a year of birth. <laughs> God. Please tell me I'm not going to fuck a bird. <laughs> God. They do. That seems a little hasty. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> That aside, what are you here to buy, you? <laughs> Your love of quo. Oh, hey, hey, hey. Whoa. My, uh, you, yeah, that's, we're not. I'm not good enough. Oh, well, I'll have to try again later. What? No, it, it's not that. It's, it's a, you're a bird. <laughs> well, I mean, no, I'm, I'm in a game full of birds. I mean, it's a given that I'm going to end up dating a bird at some point, but come on. <laughs> Uh, I think that's a little rude. Let it slide. Let it go. Just let it go. It's not like it's surprising coming from him. Oh my god. Today's an elective day. What should I do? Okay, I'll go to math class today because I haven't done that yet. Math class. I always find myself wondering what the math we learn is good for. Oko-san's sleeping it off, yeah. And now we can draw a line perpendicular to the... Yep, my thoughts exactly. Is this math class or nap time? Hey, I leveled up. Wisdom increased by five. 
Hey, I'm smarter. Today is Tanabata. There's probably a bamboo tree in the plaza this year, too. I think I'll go make a wish. Wow, there are lots here already. Any birdie I know? May my, may mother stay healthy this year and may my stomach get better. Ryota. Aww. Uh, that would probably be Oko-san. What should I wish for? Conquer the world by force. Hell yeah. Rule the world from the shadows. Become a famous artist. I'd like to be a famous artist, I think. I wish to become a famous artist whose work is known the world over. Oh, hello. Is that you, Bellin? Mr. Nanaki. You should be careful out this late. It can be dangerous for a girl you know. I was about to head home. Would you like me to walk you to your place? Oh, yes, Sensei, please. Um. Yes, please. Yeah. All right. Thank you, Sensei. Mr. Nanaki demonstrated some extreme sleeping on the way home, but we arrived eventually. Your house is very rustic, Bellum. I like it this way. It's a cave, for God's sake. It's wonderful to have a place to come back to, isn't it? Wonderful indeed. He looks a little sad. Um, sir? See you tomorrow. Don't forget your homework. And so he left, a somewhat hollow-sounding farewell echoing behind him. Or was it just my imagination? Don't you have a cave, sir? Okay. I am going to call it a day here and take a break. And I will see you next time, folks. Bye-bye.